22 days until the election. When election day arrives and you wake up full of anxiety about what's going to happen that day in terms of the election results. When you wake up on the morning of election day, will you be able to say to yourself that morning, well, whatever happens, I know that I did all I could do. The whole country right now has collective anxiety and frankly, collective dyspepsia over what's going to happen in the election with the Congress and a lot of states with the governor's race um, or the control of the legislature with the all important control of the United States Senate and of course with the presidential race. The only thing I can tell you to do to protect your mental health and reduce both your anxiety and your stomach acid is to do it now. Sit down, talk with your family or your partner or your best friend or your kids or whoever you make important decisions with. Figure out what you personally can do to apply your own self toward bringing about the election outcome that you want. And then go do it right away. <laughs> we are, it, it, I mean, we're here. If you are going to do anything, this is the time to do it. I mean, and yes, that, that's your personal voting plan in terms of getting your vote in and your vote counted. But it's more than that, right? If you have money to donate, now is the time. If you are going to phone bank for a candidate or for a proposition or for a party, now is the time. If you are going to volunteer for a candidate or for a campaign, now is the time. If you are going to sign up to be a poll worker and you haven't done so already, now is the time. And the time for thinking about it, for, for, for pondering it, for trying to imagine yourself doing something like that. The time for all of that is coming to an end. It's now time to go. I'm just saying, I'm saying it because I care about you and I'm worried.